So, I saw this tweet from Yahoo Sports, and oh gosh, <laughs> it it made me. I had some feelings. So, yeah, you click the uh, the Yahoo <laughs> link here. This is not the Onion for some some reason. Like it yeah, is, this, this kind of, it seems like the onion. This very much feels like an onion article. Uh, but <laughs> if you read the article, it okay, says well, here. Yeah, read read the headline here. All right, what so, are we talking about? Okay, so this says Michigan State announces basketball team will now be called MSU Spartans, presented by Rocket Mortgage, which actually makes me. It's hard to say. It's hard to talk about. Spawn con. <laughs> uh, yes. So the team that I root for is now Spawn con. <laughs> uh, Sponsored so, content in so, case. Uh, in case yeah, you didn't you, watch our other, you video. our other video. Yeah, this is a this is a cross post mm-hmm. to the dictionary dot com video that we that we made yeah. also this week. Um, go and watch that. Click a uh, click like on it if you want, or just ignore that we're even talking about a different video (laughs) and that you know i have deep shame about this problematic thing here so uh this is an article by jack bear who's a writer and it doesn't seem like he's an onion writer this seems (laughs) like it's a yahoo sports writer yeah and i feel feelings uh it goes in an age where sponsor patches are on every nba uniform and the nike swoosh has even hit mlb jerseys maybe it was only a matter of time before companies started pushing for the actual names of major american sports teams uh michigan state entered such territory on thursday by announcing a massive expansion in its endorsement deal with rocket mortgage Yes, rather than call them Michigan State Spartans, the team will now receive the following treatment in the East Lansing Breslin Center. Under the new, this is a quote from probably the announcement of the endorsement deal. Mm -hmm. Under the new five-year deal, Detroit-based Rocket Mortgage will be the presenting sponsor of the famed men's basketball team, which will now be known throughout the Breslin Center as MSU Spartans, presented by Rocket Mortgage. Uh, okay. A day later, after a barrage of online mockery, Michigan (laughs) State released another statement clarifying it wasn't really undergoing a name name change, just presenting sponsorship, which which it says is nothing new. So they say, uh, while this is a new extension of the partnership for Rocket Mortgage with men's basketball, this is not a first-of-its-kind sponsorship for the Spartans or a new concept in professional or collegiate team partnerships. It is a presenting sponsorship of the Michigan State men's basketball season, which is a common practice in both college and pro sports. This is nothing new for the school or the industry. Michigan State. It's no big deal, guys. Don't worry about it. Yeah, just like forget that this like is, this is a normal thing no, Everyone, yeah we everyone's just doing it. everyone's got that going on mm-hmm. uh this all might be a matter of some matter of semantics as the spartans did literally say they will be known as them as two spartans presented <laughs> by rocket mortgage <laughs> but that's apparently not the name just a suffix that will be attached to the team everywhere in sight on its home <laughs> turf okay. yeah okay so six of one half dozen of the other is apparently the uh yeah the idea here and it's all part of an effort that michigan state says is intended to make the company synonymous with spartan athletics the company of rocket mortgage which is uh what they're trying to convince people to buy houses is that like what it i don't even know how that has anything to do with college students playing basketball i mean just lots of people watch basketball it's exposure it's exposure yes If you're wondering why Michigan State is willing to go through all this, the Detroit Free Press reports the athletic department is projected to lose $75 million due to Uh, COVID-19, which (laughs) is a big reason. This is a big reason why they're, in a lot of ways, like forcing kids to play through Mm -hmm. COVID-19. 
Yeah. And I read some stuff about like potential cover ups with uh, athletes getting COVID because they don't want the money to go away when they have to shut down and not play the games. So then like still having them play. Still having them play. Uh, I haven't heard anything about that with Michigan State, but I've heard about it with just in general that there's like a widespread cover up where it's happening Mm -hmm. in a lot of colleges because uh, the amount of money that these colleges get from uh, student athletes and especially from basketball is obscene. Mm-hmm. And it creates a whole extra incentive to do a bunch of weird stuff. Um, it's its own athletic industrial complex that's sort of plaguing these these colleges. Um, sure. But they're opting in. They want it. Wow. So I, I'm curious to know how much like Rocket Mortgage paid for this. Yeah. And then also to know it, like, in, like, verbally speaking, like, whenever the games are on the air or whatever. I don't know. I don't watch basketball. But, like, will they have to say, every time they say, like, the Spartans, will they have to say MSU Spartans presented by Rocket Mortgage? Based on the follow-up from the Michigan State account, it doesn't seem like it. Mm-hmm. But I think that would be pretty hilarious. <laughs> like, if... Like, if I wasn't an MSU fan, I would love hearing, like, every time somebody said MSU Spartans, someone else correcting them to say, like, no, actually, it has to be Michigan State Spartans by presented by Rocket Mortgage. Yeah. Presented by Rocket Mortgage could be the new just, like, short name of the team. Mm -hmm. Like, if you were talking about the teams, you could Mm -hmm. be like, all right, here's Duke, and they're up against presented by Rocket Mortgage. (laughs) In the NCAA tournament. Yeah. Uh, Michigan State is playing in the NCAA tournament this year again. Uh, Okay. Part of the first four games that are being played on Thursday, uh, which is this week. And we're starting against UCLA, which we may lose that game. But that's all right. (laughs) Um, it wasn't so, the best so, year for my team. And so you, Adam, are a fan of... Uh... Full disclosure, I <laughs> yeah. watched Michigan State Spartans bas- presented by Rocket Mortgage basketball team <laughs> and yes. uh, haven't been as like staunchly watching it this year. I've seen mm-hmm. probably four or five games total. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean... Part of it is that I just can't feel good about... It? Yeah, that, I can't like, feel good about it. That's the thing is that I feel like they should have canceled the season, and I know that the reason why that didn't happen was because of money. Yeah, because it's such a huge money maker, and they didn't want to lose out on that. It's like the same reason the Super Bowl happened. Yeah, like yeah, but it's just like watching these games and like. You see refs with masks and like coaches with masks, but as soon as a play happens, the coach is yelling at a at a Mm -hmm. a player with it pulling his mask down, and players like a foot away is just yelling at him. And you're like, (laughs) you're like, what's the point of this 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 mask that you're wearing if you're just gonna pull it down to like speak to a kid about Mm -hmm. like his on court performance? It's just like, and the kids aren't wearing like the students are not wearing masks while they're playing. Like, like they've risked so many people's lives by yeah. doing this, like for the sake of money. And I mean, I, I know that's kind of the country it's our, we it's live in. It's our it's our modus operandi here yeah. in the United States. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, this is interesting. It'll be, uh, yeah. I'll be intrigued to see if this happens with any other teams as well. It sort of ends up seeming though that. They published this as like a clickbait article. Yeah. On Thursday. Mm hmm. And then MSU responded and they updated the article mm-hmm. to include the statement. Sure. Uh, so it does seem sort of like, oh, we thought this thing, but it's obviously too stupid to be actually true. Um, not the onion, but also maybe not 100% uh, on the level. Mm hmm.